Today, we will talk about top 10 best cities to live in. What makes a city the greatest of the world? For more than 15 years, residents of consultancy group in real estate, tourism, and economic development has taken a holistic approach to a popular best of list. 1. London, England London is rarely quiet these days, says residents. Most of the Tudes lines are running at its pre-COVID cadence, with added metro stops like the October 2022 open Bond Street's Elizabeth Station. Thanks to policies that give the UK the lowest corporate tax rate among G7 countries, residents says London's resilience has been buoyed by a sinking currency that has attracted investment and, of course, previously priced out tourists and new residents who can now afford to check off a big item on the multi-millionaire bucket list, property in the planet's most coveted city. Why we love it? London's main sites might date back millennia, but the capital shops, bars, hotels, and restaurants continue to evolve on an almost weekly basis. Whether you're outdoorsy, hungry, or bringing a family in town, there's a distinct London neighborhood to investigate, and it will likely look different from your last visit. Two. Paris, France, the city remains the most visited on the planet. With 44 million visitors last year, resident says. Good thing Paris Charles de Gaulle Airport used the past three years of lower volume to invest 250 million euros into a renovation of Terminal 1. Reopened this year, it now has a colossal junction building and a central lobby full of the latest tech to improve the traveler experience. Rail access and infrastructure are also unprecedented. A seven-hour direct Berlin to Paris TGV line launches next year, with more ambitious directs like the Venice to Paris midnight trains coming in 2025. No matter how they arrive, what Paris visitors new and returning will find is a city that has codified pedestrianism and alfresco living. 3. New York City, United States The pandemic exodus led some to believe New York City's reign was over. But this U.S. city's number three, ranking the same as last year, proves that it's not going anywhere. Residents says tourism numbers for the city are skyrocketing from 33 million visitors in 2021, which was less than half of 2019's numbers, to a projected 61 million in 2023. NYC is welcoming back visitors in style with major upgrades to its international gateways. LaGuardia Airport Newark Liberty International Airport and John F. Kennedy International Airport all have new terminals, with the new terminal B at LaGuardia alone boasting 35 gates and looking fine. Ritz-Carlton New York, Nomad, and Thompson in Midtown are only a few of the impressive hotels ready to host incoming visitors. Check out AFR's review of the $3,200 a night a man. 4. Tokyo, Japan the Japanese government remains steadfast, keeping its target of 60 million visitors and $136 billion in tourism revenue by 2030. It's not as delusional as it sounds. The country enjoyed record tourism for seven straight years and can now accommodate even more with the expansion of the international terminal at Haneda, the city's main airport, ranked 38 globally and a planned 18-minute rail link from arrivals to downtown by 2031, says residents. There's much ado around Japan's recent reopening to international travelers and as the world's best city for shopping. Wallets will likely open on their visit to spots like the newly renovated Manashita Park. 5. Singapore Shooting up from its number 9, ranking on the 2023 world's best cities list, Singapore has become one of the continent's most captivating cities according to residents. And it's not just iconic views from the rooftop infinity pool of Marina Bay Sands that are grabbing people's attention. A new waterfront district is being explored just south of the airport, called the Great Southern Waterfront, which is slated to build 9,000 housing units along Singapore's southern coast. The report says, locals are also buzzing about the forthcoming NS Square, a future outdoor multipurpose venue in the downtown core area of Marina Bay that will replace the popular Marina Bay floating platform. 6. Dubai, United Arab Emirates Famed for outlandish developments like Palm Jumeirah, home to Atlantis, the Palm, and the made famous by Tom Cruise Burj Khalifa, the tallest building in the world the city has, over the years, 
made breaking world records in national pastime. Tallest, longest, fastest, largest, resonance says. Moving forward, Dubai's 2040 Urban Master Plan aims to make it feel smaller by developing a 20-minute city in which city residents can access 80% of their daily needs and destinations by either a 20-minute walk or bike ride. 7. San Francisco, United States Despite San Francisco's steep population decline and an office vacancy of about 30%, city leaders remain undeterred, says residents. The city is rolling out the most daring bike and pedestrian infrastructure in America and the protected bike network, now boasts 464 miles of bikeways, including 50 miles of new car-free car light streets in the past year alone. Global talent continues to come, thanks to high salaries in the Bay Area, which, Resonance says, remains the number one place for startup innovation. Powered by venture capital, kept interested in the city's famed ecosystem for talent, for research, and for universities. 8. Barcelona, Spain Barcelona is an almost ideal European city, one with great weather year-round and era-spanning neighborhoods that are destinations at all hours, says residents. Add bike friendliness to the list. According to the World's Best Cities report, travelers coming to the city will find more than 150 miles of new bike lanes, as well as daring initiatives like Axos Verds, Green Axis, a network of quieter roads that share space equally between cars, bikes, and pedestrians, and are dotted with benches and community squares. 9. Amsterdam, Netherlands According to residents, an attitude of care for others and willingness for locals to do the work is reflected in the city's top five ranking in its livability score. Just look at the approach Mayor Halsma's administration took in accommodating unhoused migrants during the refugee crisis. Making its livability sustainable has led to several efforts on the tourism end. Over the summer, City Council moved to ban cruise ships from the city center as part of its clean air efforts. Residents says tours and programs focusing on the city's enviable livability and Dutch history are also encouraging tourists from the city center and out to the eight-ranked shopping and 11-ranked museums that pepper the city. 10. Seoul, South Korea in an astonishingly short span, South Korea's capital has 180 ed from war-ravaged city to high-tech hub, says residents. The city's ascent is boosted by our eight lowest poverty rate ranking, sixth most global 500 firms located in town, and a growing startup ecosystem waiting its turn to disrupt the incumbents. All that innovation is sated by the 176 Michelin-rated venues that have earned Seoul a three ranking in our restaurant subcategory. What do you think of our video? Let me know in the comment section below. Before you go, please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching.